and welcome back to my channel. Sorry for that. My name is Alex. If you're new, I'm just doing a week in my life. Same thing that I did last week. If you missed that video, it's my last video. You should go watch it. Um, not crazy exciting, but realistic. Anyway, I'm just about to work out. I'm doing Sammy Clark's form workouts at the moment. This is week four that I'll be on and staying consistent and I definitely have seen some results. I can make a video of some of the most like effective workouts that I've seen or I can just do like progress. Also, I'm thinking about starting 75 soft July 1st um, and then just doing these workouts like one of them a day I know it's supposed to be one 45 minute workout instead of two since 75 hard is two but I think doing like one workout at all um, should suffice and then I want to follow a meal plan or diet I gotta figure out what that is I'm thinking animal based so lots of fruits, veggies, low carb. Yeah, I don't know. I think I'm gonna do that, but welcome back and just keep on watching if you're interested. Oh, this week, um, Monday says 35 minute booty and abs Pilates, which should be probably killer. Um, I gotta see the so resistance bands and ankle weights, each workout tells you what um, equipment you're gonna need. So that's nice that this one's weight free in the sense of like dumbbells. But yeah, it's like a 35 minute. Her Pilates style ones are more of like a flow, but then she has some that are more circuit-esque or repetitive. But yeah, I'm gonna do this and then I'm gonna make a snack or maybe make dinner that's already me but i'll show you i think i'm gonna go to trader joe's today after i work out hopefully i think i just need some more bits for dinner but luckily i'm in walking distance so at least i'll get some fresh air go on a walk go to trader joe's come back and then workout. I think I'm going to put my workout clothes on and then walk to Trader Joe's. Walk back, do workout, cook dinner, shower, go to bed, get in bed early, read some of my book. I'm reading the book, Buy Yourself the Fucking Lilies. Um, I don't know the author. I can check later, but I'm trying to just read like a little bit every day, especially since I'm going to do 75 soft. I want to like gear myself up to read because I'm not normally an avid reader. So... Yeah, that's what's on the agenda for the rest of the day, but let's go home and reassess. Oh my gosh. I mean, you can actually tell. Look at that. 35 minute full body workout. Whoa, we got some wacky light going on. Brutal, brutal. My hair looked pretty okay before this. After not so much. By the way, this set so cute it's from aloe it's like a white camo i don't think they sell it still um but if they ever bring it back definitely like look i'm literally shaking definitely get your hands on it it's so cute Whew. yeah i'm gonna make some dinner after this I'm not going to the grocery store tonight i'm gonna try and use what i have which should be good, it's good to not waste food, so I'm glad I'm doing that. Um, I'm gonna use what I have, I think I'm gonna make some sort of version of Italian wedding soup. So I will show you what I do, but I need to get a shower first. Okay, quickly before I take them off, hopefully, crossing my fingers are done, crossing my fingers that they're not over, done. Right here, I have my homemade frozen meatballs. They're just chicken meatballs. And I'm trying to find which best way to um, eat them. And then here, I just made a little pasta and I'm gonna pour the meatballs 
and broth over the pasta and cross my fingers that tastes good and I'm gonna add a little bit of salt pepper parm and butter to it and hopefully it's good okay sorry that I have love island going sorry that this isn't the best angle but I'm gonna be so real this doesn't look the best but sometimes those are the ones that taste really good okay move on not as soft as I wanted it to be, but one bite. Here we go. Sorry, it's so hot. Definitely my favorite way to eat it. So it looks like it looks like chicken noodle soup out of a can. But yeah, noodles are good. Yeah, I'm gonna wash the violin and enjoy this. Okay. Good morning. Um, I thought I would show my little makeup routine I've been doing for work. Just this little switch up for the video. I have these little hair clips that I put in from Kitsch. I just got them at Ulta, but... Oops. Firstly, I go in with this Cora Organics... Um moisturizer it's a turmeric moisturizer that's why it's literally yellow next i'm gonna go in with this founders oh, refi primer then i don't and you can kind of use it as like a gua sha i usually don't but i mean you can i'm just going in with this tarte shape tape radiant I will not be repurchasing this. Um, I got the shade Medium Sand. It's like my summer shade. I'm just gonna use this Refi Bronzer. This is like my nails dug into it. I'm hitting pan. There's like a combination of things going on here. It looks a little intense at the moment. Oh, I also have the Refine brush. Um, yeah, when this brand like first became a thing, I was obsessed and just went ahead and bought like everything they had. Um, since then, I've calmed down a little bit, but yeah. And then the blush is so small, which is so funny. But I guess you probably use way more bronzer than you would blush. Also hitting pan on that. I've had these products a while, so it's making sense actually. And now that I've been doing like my makeup and stuff for work, which is like at least three times as mo like three times as much as I usually would be doing my makeup. Like I usually would do my makeup like once or twice a week, like if I didn't have to work. But I actually enjoy getting ready and like having this time in the morning to do my makeup. I've been taking this also from Ulta. I'm telling you, like if you can buy your stuff cheap, like I love the Sephora lip liners so much. And then this Ulta stuff. It's called Wind Down. It's an eyeliner. And I've been putting it right next to my lash line. Smudge it out. There, you can see it. And this is a Tweezerman lash curler. It's definitely my favorite lash curler I've tried. I don't know the frequency as to like how often to buy a lash curler, but I definitely want to try like the Shiseido one. And then I'm just gonna go ahead and set my face. I kind of do a lot of this, so just fair warning, but. Okay, here they are. <laughs> um, now, lastly, I'm just going to do, I think lastly, I'm not gonna do lip liner or anything just yet. I usually do it, oh, that reminds me, I need to sharpen my little lip liner. Um, I do it in the car when I'm, like when I get to work, when I park, um, just because I'm about to eat breakfast and things like that, so. 
I'm just using this brow freeze by Anastasia. Yeah, I'm probably gonna leave my hair down yesterday. I left it down, but I brought a clip with me and like was pulling it back all day. So I'm guessing that'll probably be today's vibe too. Okay, gonna make breakfast. If I make anything fun, I'll show you. If not, I might just make some toast, bacon, eggs, basic stuff. Okay. Okay. Oops, I need to throw an earring on. But other than that, I'm ready for work. I'm trying to see the best angle here. Show the outfit. Okay. Zara button down blouse. It's like silky. This is a vintage Calvin Klein belt from my mom. I'm just wearing these blue wash Zara jeans. They're like my favorite wash. They're just such a good blue. And I'm wearing these little halogen mules that are pretty comfortable and yeah, good for work, but yeah, that's the outfit. Okay, I just did my form workout, and if the camera's shaking, it's because my arm is shaking. Also, this is the aloe set of the day. It's called the Heartthrob set, and I used to work there. If you're wondering about all my aloe knowledge, that's why. Um, <laughs> best job ever, but it was 28 minutes full upper body. Did it with 10-pound dumbbells. My arms are shaking. They're going to be numb tomorrow. I'm going to feel like a literal noodle walking around with no feeling in my arms. But I'm just trying to get my arms like really toned. Okay. We're about to go to Trader Joe's. It's like a mile, not even a mile walk. I'm vlogging. Oh, um, yes. And I'll do a grocery haul when we get back. So. Update's coming shortly. It's fine. Here's the hall. Switching up, you're getting an alternate camera angle. Um, no, I'm okay. Those are really good too. The corn dogs, so good. Dish. No. Fuck one of one. This one. This is the best one that they have in the store. I swear to God. Really? I've never had that one. This one is so gas but though. We're on the health night, so that's we just are. So Meanwhile, I have one of those green chili mac and cheese sitting in the fridge that I'm definitely gonna make on my gone crazy, go crazy. Oh gosh, this makes me want to go back too. to that ice cream place and get that um, matcha. Ice cream. Ice cream. Yeah, that was so. These, good. in terms of like power rankings, <laughs> no, I know, but oh, point of uh, power rankings. Oh, I'm getting these. These Are those new? sound incredible. Yeah, I've never seen these. Matcha review. It's just sweet, oh. but the soy milk like cuts the sweetness, and you have to get cinnamon. Okay, we're going on a date. I don't know where we're going. I'll show you when we go though, but I wish I'm gonna turn my camera around here in a second. So I bought all the drying clothes. Um, I'm wearing this maxi dress. It is from Lioness. And then I just have some jewels on. Hoop earrings. Some makeup. I gotta show Samsung too because he looks so cute. That's what the back's looking like. Oh, just yeah. in time. Oh, TV. Okay, I got a video. Alright. So um, cute. Wearing it. This little fit. Little fit that Your I got. backup is it's in like, oh, oh, I can like zoom out a little bit. Maybe 0.5. I know, but my camera's whack. <laughs> All right. Zara top. Zara top, um, blue lab bottoms, mm -hmm. and European Stan Smiths. Stonin. <laughs> It's 
have anything on the back? No. What'd you get? Was it freckled mint Review? Solid banana. Got a little baby scoop of the uh, classic sea salt and caramel ribbons. Gas. Certified gas. This is like a 8 8 scoop. Just paid $11 for two baby little scoops of ice cream. Man, I love LA. Oh, and these guys had the audacity to ask for a tip? For this size of a scoop? Are you kidding? Are you kidding? I don't know about you guys, but I have a policy where if I'm standing up and a person is also standing up, I ain't tipping. My coffee, ain't tipping. Only thing I don't really tip out anymore is like full service restaurant. I mean, I'm sitting down in the restaurant and someone's coming to me. If I gotta, even if I gotta like walk up to a ordering stand and then they bring it to me, I'm still not tipping. I don't know. Leave it down in the comments below. Let me know if you're still tipping because this is getting out of control. Okay. Sorry I haven't actually properly talked to the vlog. I mean, I think the last thing you're going to see is probably Sam talking about how he doesn't pay people behind, behind the register. That's probably the last him. time that... Yeah, you don't tip them. Which, no, which I agree with. So, But I think that's probably the last thing you would have seen. Um, but it's the next day. I have mascara running down my face, so that's cool. Um, we're going to get brunch. Just chilled by the pool, went to church. We're doing a little bit of everything. And we're gonna go to Target. <laughs> so, what's going on at the moment? But I'm gonna take this moment opportunity to do a little review. We have, right, you want to explain what you got going on here? Oh, this is a Trader Joe's Ice Pop, which if you haven't tried, absolute gas. We're doing that with the uh, bubbly melted ice pop. And he's Pepper. also never tried any bubbly before. Yeah, I'm like a, somewhat of a, a LaCroix fan occasionally, but and they're only, not a soda cake. I've only tried so. the cherry bubblies, and they taste like a melted movie theater slushy, like a red one, which is... Kind of like what this should taste like as well, but let's see. But every time people say that, you hear that and you're like, you think it's going to be really good and then it barely tastes like, it tastes like 1% of what well, you want it to taste like. I mean, like. it's definitely faint. And then I'm trying, well, we're going to try both, but I'm trying the coconut pineapple. I'm trying it without that first, but that's going to, yeah, I know gonna that's going to make it more better. flavorful. For sure. Cheers. Cheers. Exactly what I expected it to taste like. It's good, oh, but it's like, that is gonna, that's gonna be the right. difference. Trade, trade it's just a little fried. Mm. Mm. This one's a little bit more flavored than that one, I think. I like this one. Yeah, that one's gas. <laughs> this like, one's yeah, gas. Yeah, that one's gas, give me a bit. And I'm putting it. Okay, I just got to work. It's Monday. I'm going to end off this vlog here because I'm gonna start a new one this week when I get home and so I can get this one from last week up today by tonight. I'll have some time to 
edit tonight so that should be good and yeah thank you so much for watching and see you in the next one